Welcome to Zilliqa Zibra's News Digest, where I will summarize the latest news and updates on all things Zilliqa. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to Zilliqa Zebra to receive the latest digest of news and updates related to Zilliqa at your fingertips. Zil4 Virtual Town Hall, which took place on the 30th of July, provided a good summary of past achievements for the year and the strategy for the year ahead. Of significance was what Amrit Kumar reiterated several times, to ensure that Zilliqa continues to attract users that actually use those chains. Comparison was made with Ethereum, who has the largest number of developers, but not as many users. He added that the best way to exist and compete is for Zilliqa to innovate as much as possible and to attract more users with really useful dApps, leading to many transactions which will burn Zilliqa, leading to scarcity. In another note, Liquid Global is supporting XSGD deposits and withdrawals via Zilliqa and waiving withdrawal fees for the moment. With XSGDD, ZRC2 support from Liquid, more users can now tap into various decentralized applications in the growing Zilliqa ecosystem. ZillSwap has released their 2.0 roadmap update with multi-reward claiming, ZillBridge for Zilliqa Ethereum mainnet, ZillSwap NFT and another Zylo coming up in quarter 3. It's going to be an exciting quarter. Lastly, Zillflip has shared their preview for linking Minecraft to your Zillica wallet. Also watch out for Zillica Royale, where players can earn loot bosses by playing games or providing liquidity for the block's token. That's all I have for this edition of the Zillica Zebra News Digest. If you'd like me to cover any news, do PM me at my Twitter at Zillica Zebra. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for your regular dose of Zilliqa news. And check out my other videos which might be of interest to you.